Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to do a quick haul. Um, I filmed it earlier but it was a bit jumpy so I'm going to redo it again. Um, this is the range haul because um, I went with my boyfriend earlier today. Um, I am now back in the UK. I came back yesterday and I have a cold. I got cold three days to the end of my actual holiday so I am a little bit nos nosy and all bunged up a little bit so I'm on um, Lemsip Map Strength, yay! Hopefully I'll get over this cold soon. Um, but I am going to show one thing I got from America. I am going to do a haul um, from America. Not with everything that I got because um, I've already given it to my boyfriend and what I got him. So, and it is really nice even though he's got some nice stuff from me. But I didn't want to show all of it so it's only stuff that I have got for myself. And I will show that in the next haul. Um, because I've got some crafting stuff as well so I'll put it all in the same haul and once I've done the crafting stuff you can switch off um, so hopefully fingers crossed it'll be up soon and I'll do that for you so um, as I said I've got one thing from um, America which is um, from Walmart um, it was about $5 because everywhere over here I've only seen it for $7.99 or um, more I've not seen it any cheaper and I've not seen it in our Asda's, which is Walmart um, in the UK. Um, but it's a circle hole punch, one inch. Um, I finally actually gone and got one. Um, I've not actually got a hole punch, um, and I like some of the circles that people have been doing to put into their craft, scrapping, and onto Project Life and stuff like that. And I thought this is something that I desperately need, and I've never seen one any cheaper than seven ninety nine, even on eBay. I've never seen anything that's cheaper than seven ninety nine, so I got this for a really really good price, and I can't wait to use it. So it's still in its packaging, as you can see. This one is from Eek Tools, and as you can see, it's just a one inch or punch. That is just a piece of card that they put over the top. So I'm looking forward to using it. I also got um, also as I said, um, this is from the range now. So everything from here is from the range now. Um. In in my local one, we have um, some stickers and stuff, and they're not very brilliant. But I thought this just said sticker pad, and it, that's all it says really. It says block note stickers. Um, I thought it would be all like alphas and in different colours. So I thought, oh, I'll get a few sheets of each of different colours, and you get like letters like that. But they're not actually what I thought they would be because you only get three actual um, pages of those because the rest of them are um, fellow like welcome little baby and so it's basically pregnancy like baby new baby things and as far as I know my my friends are not pregnant I'm not pregnant so I don't know what I'm going to use them for so it's something that's going to be kept in my stash because. I think soon some of my friends will get pregnant but at the moment none of them are so until then that's just gonna have to be left I'm afraid so I've only got three sheets that I can actually use which is a bit of a shame but they are only um, £1.50 for this pack um it's not a bad buy but I'm a little bit disappointed because I thought it would be block um letters and you can't see into this because it's actually in the plastic sheet cover so it was a bit of a deceiving really because it doesn't even say on the back what's in it. So I just thought, oh you see that, it's going to be all like this all the way through, but in different colours. So I'm a little bit disappointed in that, but oh well. What can you do? Um, so yeah. Um, also I got, as everybody knows, I like my gorgeous girls. A lot of people on YouTube like them as well, um, especially in the crafting community. Um, and you normally get the stamps for like five ninety five in the range. So um, as you know, they were done by Santono, Santono London, which is the company. And I've got two stamps. I've got um, the Dreamer, which is this pack. Let's see if I can get the glare off. There it is. The glare's off now. As you can see, it's so gorgeous with the fox and everything. And um, it's a which um, how many? Which one is it? This is a 10 piece one, um, each one's got different, so you've got a 12 piece or a 10 piece or an 8 piece, depends on which one you get. 
and I really really like that one I think that's quite a gorgeous one you can have a bit of fun with the hair on this one but I used to have I normally have fun with the hair anyway on most of mine um, that was 446 so that's just reduced only a little bit but at least it's a little bit of a saving and then I've got this one which is Hush Little Bunny um, let's see if I can do the same there we go so this one's a 10 piece and you get like a like a strip in and then a frame and everything to go with it so I quite like them I think they're absolutely to die for really and also they have like they've got a lot more stuff there they've got some of the paper packs um, but as I'm gonna say each range is completely and utterly different and what they've got on reduction on reduced and you're just gonna have to look at the reduction area really to see what there is um, as I've just been to America I didn't have much money left over so I ended up getting a little bit so I got this pack which is a six by six inch cards and envelopes and you get two of each um, design which is there I'll show you in a minute what they're like because the one cool thing about this um, this pack like any of the paper packs or anything like that so you get like the cards and then of course you just get plain inside and then you get the back and then you've got like all different colours I think I'm missing one actually because I think that's the reason why it's reduced oh no I'm not at the bottom so they're all the same and then there's your little envelopes that you get with them to put them in so the one thing I do like about oh, let me drop that the one thing I like about these is because the packaging you get toppers and frames so you get little free little bits in them so you can cut them out and put them on and stuff like that so like even like these little bits you could add them into like scrapbooks and project life and I just like them so I end up cutting them out and then just placing them on certain things the only problem is it is a little bit damaged around this circle one as you can see like a lot somebody's ripped it to try and see what they can see what was inside and it actually does show you on the actual front of what they are this is what I can't understand why do people have to open up stuff especially when it's sealed the sealed is for a reason and if you can't see that it's actually got a bit of sellotape over the top then I'm not being funny why are you trying to open it just me I that's my only pet heave that I do not like I think I think that's rude I think if you do it if you damage it why should you damage it you should be the one that pays for it because you damaged it in the first place I've done that I went and was very very clumsy when I was little and I used to paint these like china things and locked one off the shelf and we ended up buying it and they were like oh it's broken I went that's because I broke it I'd rather buy it because at the end of the day it's a waste and my dad actually glued it back together for me so that I could actually paint it so I think uh, coming from where I've been if you break something you should buy it that's just me so um, but that's all I got from the range I told you it's only a little haul but I just wanted to do a little video just to say that I am back and I hope everybody is well and you can see a little bit of my tan on me it's not that brilliant with this lighting but you can see it just there I am a little bit browner than I was when I, and as of course I am fair, I don't get browny very easily. I do burn. So hopefully in my next video you might see me with a bit more better um, camera and everything. Because I am using my laptop for this one. Um, but I will be using my Canon very, 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 very soon. And I'll be doing a haul. I'm going to be starting my um, albums with the 6x6 for my project life for the actual holiday um, I am doing my project life I will be doing that separately I am a little bit behind as most of you know I caught myself up just before I went on holiday and now I'm back behind again so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a block of it and then just film it like a flip through and then once I'm back up to scratch I will do it a week by week of what I did before um, if you want to see anything down like what you want video wise just post it in the comments below and I will get back to you as soon as possible and I will reply um, and also if you haven't please subscribe I am new to this this community and I am loving it so far I've got a few friends that I do talk to um, on here so and I am on um, a Facebook group as well uh, which is another girl that I watch on YouTube and she just she makes me laugh in her videos and she does it in real time 
which I'm going to start thinking about doing it in real time soon and do the voiceover because well, I do a voiceover at the end and I don't feel confident doing it that way I think doing it like I am now is a lot better for me I am a bit of a chatter no worries but I normally, I normally what I normally do is um, put music on and do my crafting but I'm thinking I might actually just do what she does and then I might even have Monty walking around at the same time because he does like to sit with me in my room where I'm doing it um, because he likes sitting in that room for some strange reason um, he's picked my room over the main front room um, but yeah as I am looking after mum and dad as well but I work 36 and a half hours I'm a full timer so I will look after my parents and I do the, my crafting as well so I do try and squeeze it in and of course I've got a boyfriend who um, helps me out as well so I'm, I've got the best of both worlds um, not really much else to say but the reason why if you can see on my wrist I've got a really faint it's really faint on this camera um, but you can see the thing it's because I was wearing this the whole entire holiday which is my magic bank so as I'll show you put it on quickly just to show you what it was like and then you can see what I mean by why I've got the wrist like that so as you can see there's no it's not even that bad there but as soon as you take it off there's the wrist colour so you can see I have got a bit of a difference in my tone of my skin which I'm quite happy about. My shoulders have got a lot more colour on it. But I think that's just because of the way that I was wearing what I was wearing and everything. Because I didn't wear as many tops like this. I wore like carry tops like this most of the time I was on holiday. So I got burnt really easily. So oh well, never mind. So I hope you like this video. I know I've wrapped up a little bit on the end, but what can you say? Um I hope you like it. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Um, if there's any videos that you want to see and you do, just post it down below and I'll get back to you of course. And of course subscribe to me. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!